And in a scenario like that, I feel like, uh, see, humans oftentimes they'll go based off of another car. So, in other words, you could see someone who makes makes an illegal turn on red, and the person behind them may go ahead and make that too because they saw the person in front of them do it. And so, if that AV does it, you know, it tries to go around. The human may say, "Oh, you know, well they did too, so I'm just going ahead." Well, and do you it. bring up a very uh, valid point, and in certain countries and with certain AVs, the alleviation to that is on the outside of the vehicle. They have started putting uh, lights mm-hmm. to let you know that this is an AV uh, vehicle. Mm-hmm. Uh, some AVs have blue lights on them to let the person behind them know that this car is being driven autonomously. This right. is not a human driving. Right. And in that scenario, you would know, say, hey, this one's marked. Let's say you turn your FSD on in your Tesla you, and you let go of the wheel. Right. Maybe your uh, your lights are blue. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Maybe your taillights how turn about, blue. How about I, I thought of that when I was a child. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's crazy. You know, the blue lights and I was like, well, the blue lights, they can drive in a certain lane because they're all in unison. I think that's where we're going, but we don't mm-hmm. have the infrastructure for that yet. Mm-hmm. We're still trying to get by the HOV and Peach Pass lines. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Exactly. And trying to get uh, Peach Pass and uh, Sun Pass to link properly. <laughs> yeah. So I, I really do believe we will have an AV lane probably in the next 20 years. Yeah. But in the, the closer in term, mm-hmm. you, you just mark the AVs and say, hey, these guys are able to go ahead and not violate, but they they operate under a different set of rules mm-hmm. than if you were to have non-AV uh, right. vehicles right. Uh, rolling around. And so I think that's w- where we need to go. That, those are conver- kind of conversations, especially on the state level, that need to be held uh, on a daily basis at this point. And start figuring out which rules they need to start, you know, start taking a really close look at and start bending and start testing and see what we can do about that.